Welcome back to the rally on this beautiful Friday night. Makes you want to go out there and play something outside. We're taking the inside, though. Movie stars, policymakers, leading thinkers, and world leaders. Many of them participated in speech when they were in high school. The Minnesota State Speech Tournament is this weekend. With Class A today and Double A tomorrow, David McCoy introduces us to one of the best this state has ever seen. At around 3 a.m., something pulled me from sleep. The sound of feet shuffling. Who's that? Who's there? Shut up or I will cut you. My specific piece is by Jennifer Thompson Canino and Ronald Cotton. It's about a 22-year-old who was sexually assaulted in her college apartment. I willed myself to look at him, to know the details. If I survived, I told myself, I would tell the police everything I could remember. It was in 1984. They didn't have modern DNA technology, so her eyewitness testimony was basically everything. Um, and she ended up accusing the wrong man. What happens when the person you hate more than anything in a situation becomes the person you've wronged the most? How can you redeem yourself? Picking Cotton by Jennifer Thompson Canino and Ronald Cotton. Allison Leopold is a senior at Mounds Park Academy in St. Paul. I've always loved acting and performing, so uh, speech is another way to do that. Leopold's category is serious interpretation of prose, which adapts a book into a 10-minute speech performance. She's won a medal each of the last three years. I screwed up. Not only was I a rape victim, but a rape victim with an extremely bad memory, and someone had to pay 11 years for that. These 10 minutes are the culmination of hours upon hours of preparation and practice over the last several months. We'll run scenes, we'll run like difficult parts, we'll run the whole thing, um, time it. We'll just work on sort of really developing the character. I forgive you, he said. Working with her is a lot of fun because she's very dedicated but also kind of laid back. That. Today, Leopold so won her fourth medal putting her into elite company. Before this, only 50 students in state history had done that. She's now number 51. That's incredible. Really, honestly, it, it takes a really talented person to be able to do that. That is incredible, and I got to tell you, every week I am amazed when we do this show about the incredible stories out there. All the kids doing wonderful things, and all the parents that must be beaming with pride. Makes it a lot of fun to do this show. 